Okay, this is what I have for breakfast right now on my lazy days. Pretty much, it's going to be cereal. I'll put some almonds and cheese seeds and some milk. Sometimes it usually be almond milk, but today uh, we got this milk. And, you know, uh, we don't want it to be expired, so. Okay. okay, so that's pretty much what it is right now. I added some hemp seeds and some flax seeds. This is the ground pack seeds, but I have the regular flax seeds right here but i just wanted to use the ground and then i didn't put the milk yet because i wanted to be soggy and pretty much that's it that's how i have my lazy breakfast um i just add some stuff to the cereal and makes it more fuller and more nice and more nutritious so yeah pretty much that's basically it Okay, bye-bye. So I blended up basically a lot of vegetables, like a lot, the mixed vegetables, if you ever get them in like frozen, like the green peas, corn, um, carrots, um, sweet peas, and then I had cauliflower as well in it, as well as some tomatoes, cucumber, and some um, iceberg lettuce in it. I just blended in them together. And I'm gonna put some chicken fry, um, some chicken fry thing in it. This is a vegetarian, so I'm just gonna basically mix the whole thing in it and make some veggie patties. I had some olive oil as well in it, so yeah. So basically, that's basically what I'm gonna be doing. Um, yeah, to make a veggie um, patty. So pretty much that's basically how it was gonna be. So I'm just gonna finish up um, mixing and what pretty I did much was basically I had um, I just um, cooked it up a little bit to get all that water contact to so for that water to evaporate because you know it has a lot of water contact with it because of the vegetables like tomato and celery and um, cucumber in it and then you know some corn and stuff like that they have a lot of water in them so I just take them out and I I just start thinking because it, it turns into a dough because of the flour i added some plain flour as well some rising flour in there a little bit but um just to get it a little thickness and then i'm gonna put it like in the air fryer i'm gonna rub it into a ball and put it in the air fryer like i'm doing with one of them and it's gonna be done so yeah that's how i make my little veggie patties like my little vegetarian burgers um so yeah pretty much not the way I expected it, so I'm probably just gonna just probably eat this like something else. I was not even gonna use the patties as a sandwich, anyways, but I'm probably just gonna eat it. They, they came out like biscuits, I guess, because I put rice and flour instead of like regular flour. But um, probably just gonna use it for something else, yeah, like for tomorrow or the next day or something like that. So. Yeah, they came out like biscuits. So, yeah, fail. Um, pretty much gonna probably just make a little sandwich out of something else. So, yeah. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna make a veggie patty-ish. So, this is the veggie patty I'm using. I got it at Dollar Tree. Um, it's, it says vegetarian. Just because the faculty has um, eggs, they faculty um, eggs and milk products, I think. I think that's what it said. No, it, it, it has um, wheat and milk based products and nuts. So it might have leftover of, you know, stuff. But the, the ingredients are just basically um, potatoes, vegetable oil, carrots, green beans, corn. Bell pepper, onion, salt, green pepper, sugar, um, ginger, and then it has like this gum in it, and then spices, citric acid, turmeric, and mustard seeds. So pretty much that's basically what it is. And then I got these breads from um, use the hummus um, from Hope. It's the spicy avocado, and then I'm gonna use the um, sola. Um, bread is a sweet oh it's like a keto type of bread and pretty much that's basically what I'm gonna be eating pretty much yeah because I'm tired and lazy <laughs>